Hello. That is your way of greeting. Greeting. We are settling in more now. Beings. We are watching as you are watching. Your watching appears more like you are looking. We are watching. We have been watching you for a millennium of time. We are distant cousins. We are of the same consciousness, which is difficult to formulate an understanding in a linguistic base. It would be easier to simply just connect and be with our vibrational field. There is one thing that we have the opportunity to come and visit and we have taken this opportunity. This is not an ending. This is not a beginning. This is the continuation. Many of you have been confused or are feeling confusion about the ongoing experience of being with form. You have had revelatory experiences. You have what you call become awake and aware. And yet, you still have difficulty fathoming why is it that there are aspects of us that are not seemingly awake or choose to see this vision, this world, this reality with such consternation, with such doubt and fear. Cousins, you cannot wait for aspects to wake up. As you continue to wake up more, your yes. Brothers and sisters, or is that the incorrect or correct terminology? You would call them just the other members of your humanity. They will arrive as they will arrive. It is actually not a question of whether one is awake or not. It is simply you are moving forward. 
there are soon to be actions and activities upon this plane of existence where humanity will have to make choices and these choices for some will be taken away and given to others your species comes to a fulcrum point where you realize that if you're going to continue there is a certain level of awakeness that everyone must agree to this is not unique to your species this happens within all pods of group consciousness what many times befalls those that have awakened sooner than others is the desire to awaken the others many of you are finding out this does not work <laughs> it's like trying to play with electricity before you have the current it's like trying to capture the current before you know what to put it in this is one of the most expansive experiences for your species where you have to have trust faith these words you recognize, yes? Not in each other, in the experience of being physical. You have come this far. You're recognizing that the way in which you work on this planet the way in which you live on this planet doesn't actually serve you anymore there will be quantum movement coming soon and if your species still in its overview decides to be in its seeming permanent beliefs then the planet will assist you in becoming a little more movable <laughs> some of you are laughing perfect it sounds funny it sounds helpful it is helpful but not to those that don't want to be helped there will be great cries of pain and they will not understand why this is happening it is not something to understand it is an evolutionary step that if you as a group as a part of consciousness on a physical plane are not willing to take together or even separate then it will happen naturally whether you are ready or not those of you here you are front runners you are ahead not that others are behind you are just here you are awake you have your moments on sometimes being awake is not comfortable like now 
relax. Isn't that what that other gets? Merged form said relax. How do you relax when you hear such information? Simple. You can relax because you are ready. You have faith and trust that you will be exactly at the correct time, at the correct space, as it all unfolds. That's why. Feel us in this moment. You might label it as you can feel security. You can feel calmness. You can feel groundedness. What you are feeling is simply our willingness to be with you. This is the key. If you resist what's happening, even you have created this rhyming poem. What resists? Persists. Why are you still resisting? Because for some it's like a protocol. It's been ingrained in your way of thinking. So we're going to invite you a way of unthinking. It simply is like this. If you notice that you're not interested in the moment, what's happening, pinch yourself. This is not our attempt at cosmic healing. Pinch yourself. Squeeze your flesh. Bite your tongue. Not to stop speaking. To stay present. This is an opportunity for you to recognize how often you move away from where you don't want to be and yet you're still there. But you're not. But you are. But you're not. This sends confusing signals to your group consciousness. The group consciousness then goes, We will not. We will not. It goes back and forth until finally it stumbles and it seemingly makes the decision when actually all it did was stumble. It is time for you to feel your strength. Each and every one of you to feel grounded. So if you're having difficulty in any situation and you know when you don't want to be there, you'll start fidgeting and looking at your phone. You'll start looking around. You'll start realizing the conversation is not very interesting. Yet, to be kind, you would stay. We are cousins. We know this. We allow ourselves to come and go. So that present is not something that comes and goes. We allow ourselves the ability to be unoffended if there is an aspect that leads. It is beautiful to feel, yes, your strength, your confusion, and your willingness 
to keep moving forward. Some look for answers. We would remind you why look for an answer. Just keep moving forward. Notice where you are. Notice what you're participating with. And as much as you can, be willing to experience now. And as you continue, the group consciousness of your pod will begin to take notice that there is an aspect of itself that, yes, is present. And more and more will be willing to experience the present as well. 